And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout. In the last video, we had hired Ian, the man in the leather jacket. The man that nobody in this village seems to know. And we got a rope, which is very important because we are now heading out to Vault 15. That's the place um, where Katrina was from. And I hope we don't have a... We have an unpleasant encounter. Oh no, it's just merchants and guards. Okay, that's not so bad. Can we talk to them? Not really. Well, hello, Wanderer. My name is Duke, and I'm headed into Shady Sands to do some trading. Perhaps I can interest you in some goods. Uh, wait, didn't we learn about some trader from the hub? Who has been selling them a faulty irrigation pump? Yes, Shady Sands is part of my normal trade route. You can travel there safely with us for safety if you like. No, thanks. Um, what do you have to for sale? Uh, nothing of particular interest. Well, I could trade maybe this ammunition for some some of these bullets. Um, and a few met one. Hmm. Let give me actually. Mm, that's not very good trade, is it? Okay. Okay, maybe I won't trade with you right now. No, that's not that's a good trade. Okay. Bye. Can't talk to. Hmm. They're not very happy. These guards. Let us leave. Uh, except if there's anything else here of interest, but that does not seem to be the case. So let's just leave. Uh, let us go to Vault 15. Uh, oh. A small, a small check is all that remains of this area. Fortunately, your records indicate a secondary entrance to Vault 15 here. And we are being greeted by a giant red scorpion. Oh, let us just hope this doesn't go horribly wrong. Good thing we hired Ian. Let us hit this poor creature into the brain. That's always a good choice. Yeah. Red Scorpion was critically, was critically hit in the brain for 12 hit points. So critical hits, um, as the name suggests, do a lot more damage. And if you have a very high luck, which as we do, your chances of getting critical hits are higher, as you might imagine. Red Scorpion was critically hit in the brain for 12 hit points, knocking the poor creature senseless. Red Scorpion was killed. You are victorious in combat. You earn 110 experience. And we got a tail. That is important because we uh, will give this to, to Raslo. Let us uh, head down. And our next enemy. 
a pig rat. And apparently it is female. And she hurts. Okay. The pig rat was critically hit in the eyes for six hit points, doing some extra damage due to the sensitive location. And it's dead. And we got a new level. Hooray. That was the wrong button. Level up. We've got 18 skill points that we can now um, distribute among these skills. Right now, of course we want to uh, bump up energy weapons. Um, also these skills should be something useful to invest into. But right now, we need to invest everything that we have into unarmed combat. Just in order to make this... Um, yeah, combat a bit... A bit easier, since after all we are playing as a... Martial Arts Sniper character, which is of course... Quite a silly... Combination, but there you go. Having a bit more skills in combat than unarmed combat does not hurt. Yeah, I, okay. I was just double checking that I uh, actually invested this into unarmed combat. It's out of range. Okay. Let us end our turn then. Sometimes, yeah, you have to be careful. Sometimes your companions, so there's friendly fire in this game, and sometimes your companions shoot you. Sh your companions shoot you. Uh, so that's one thing you have to look out for, and I'm almost dying here. Okay, um... By the way, your health restores um, if you go to rest. But you can also perform first aid on your own character. Um, you fail to heal anything. And if you're not very good at first aid, then... Yeah. It won't work. And you gain experience for... Um, Honing your skills, so using first aid, if possible, is actually um, a very good idea. The only downside of this, it takes in-game time, and sometimes you just cannot afford um, losing time. Okay, we are slightly less dead now, and as you can see, some violent... Um, Probably an explosion caused this vault door to be destroyed. This vault door. Uh, what? I think one of, yeah, one one rat bit the other to death. Okay, that was just strange. Um, I'm pretty sure it was one rat killing the other rat. There. Okay, please don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Because last time, when I was here, uh, Ian actually shot me. But it seems that we've killed all the opponents. You can always check by going into combat mode and then you can see the outlines. But it appears that we've killed all the enemies. Let us heal ourselves. Always good. Uh, the strain might kill you. Get some rest first. Okay, maybe a good idea to get some rest. But we can't. Which is sort of a bummer. Oh. 
I guess we could always go head up and then take a rest. Uh, maybe that's actually a good idea. Let us go back up and hope. Let us hope these creatures don't respawn. Can we rest? Rest for maybe two hours. Okay. Can we heal ourselves now? No. Maybe we should okay, let us rest for six hours. Can we heal ourselves now? No. Okay, fine. Then uh, rest until morning. Yeah, we've. I don't know why we've. Um, so in the cutscene it said we have 150 days to get the water chip, but here it says 4,000 days. This might be due to some of the patches that I'm using. I'm using the fixed patch for Fallout, which might actually also increases, increase your um, time limit, but I'm really shouldn't because I only... And we are still not very well rested. Let us rest until healed. Uh, this is taking a bit too long. I think we've slept two days. Okay. But I think in the end it will be... It will be worth it. Because this Vault 15 is uh, not quite not dangerous it's actually quite dangerous okay let us see a locker a storage container metal whole stuff can be locked is it locked no it's not and some flares which will become will come in handy oh Good thing we rested there. Okay, let us let me check your equipment. Um, I don't want you to run out of bullets here. So what kind of bullets are you using? So these. Okay, I have forty-eight of them. Yeah, have them all. Yeah. By the way, it doesn't matter um, whether it's a good trade or not. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I think it's a good idea that you stay close so that you don't inadvertently shoot me. Okay, the first enemy is just a rat. It's not much of a problem. Can't end combat yet. Yes. Uh, the next enemy is more of a problem. Uh, okay, and when we come back, folks, we will continue fighting this less, lesser mall rat and hopefully will not die. So until next time folks, until then.